All right, I feel like God is making me talk about this, but I train, I would say I train my kids to, when it comes to working, just go in there, be quiet and watch how people move. I feel like that's the biggest way to success in life or success in working with others, like learning the social dynamics, learning social norms. I'm not a person who is for all social norms. I feel like a lot of them are obsolete to be a, to be honest, and I'm not talking about the whole sexuality, like gender stuff. I'm not talking about those social norms. Norms. I'm talking about other social norms with um, social interactions and behaviors and just how humans coexist with one another. I can't really expand on it right now, but what I'm here to talk about right now is I teach my kids to go in there and watch how people move. Watch how people move. And what I mean by watch how people move, watch how what plays people do whether it's a person playing the nice cards to get favors, whether it's people trying to undermine um, one another and throw people underneath the bus. I feel like a lot of things happen in the real world in, in many different industries in society in general. And I feel like learning how to maybe the power the 48 laws of power it probably it definitely talks about some of this stuff i haven't read the whole book i only read some of it like the beginning so far but i think acting learning like acting is a great skill because it really teaches act and reaction like okay if somebody does this why do they act like respond this way and then also that there's many ways to respond like improv acting is a great skill to learn just regular acting whether it be stella adler um stanislavski um whatever acting techniques um but it just really teaches people social din dynamics and how to work with other people and how to be successful and i feel like if even going into like dance community environments and seeing how you know dancers act or towards one another when it comes to putting people on a pedestal or even in regular work co you know environments it could be in a regular nine to five or it could be in the industry too but like i said i train mine to just go in there and watch how people move and not everyone is your friend that's what i tell them not everyone is your friend and don't get it twisted because people switch up real quick that's all I'm saying. And that's real life. You know, I teach. I feel like I teach reality. What is one possible reality or a couple different perspectives? My experience is not everyone's experience, you know, um, but this is all I have to say for today. Thanks for listening, y'all.